black is not printing. Even after cleaning, there are a couple of red squares missing, but the black missing a lot. So after it did a self-cleaning cycle, I fixed the red. It looks like the black print head is completely jammed. So that's the problem. There's the solution. Let's see what's in this box. This is something you can buy cheap. I think 11 bucks on Amazon. Got a bottle of solution. Syringe. Connectors. Plastic gloves. And in made in China fashion, some truly terrible instructions. Which is probably why you're watching this video. Printer needs to come out. Need to free up the print head to slide back and forth. Then you can unplug the power from the printer, at which point stick some paper towel underneath it and using the solution, you gently pump that into the print lines so that the print fluid lands on the paper towel and cleans the printer. Notice it's on some plastic. It's just a trash bag. I don't think it really matters, but We'll take the print cable out of the way. So I just held down the X on this model. But a lot of these MFC family of printers have very similar looks, features, function. And then we'll unplug the power. When I hit the X, that's what came sliding out from here. Now it will slide freely. So we'll slide it over there and then stick some paper towel in it. Now, just by sliding it under there, I'm already getting some ink. So once you lay the paper down in there, it should be pretty easy to, to slide this over. I've only used one of these types, I folded it in thirds. Okay, this specific model, you just pull down forward, pull forward on the case there. I'll leave a couple pieces of paper in there, just in case things go sideways. All right, we're gonna take the printer black cartridge out. And just as a precaution, wrap some plastic wrap around that. It comes with a seal in it. Changed my mind. Visibility is too low. All of these are coming out. And then we'll securely stack them over there. And then you can see the nozzles. This is the tube that should connect there. A bit of force was required to get this uh, tube on. In other videos I've seen, or other kits I should say, that tube didn't seem like it was as challenging to put on. Don't damage it. About four milliliters in there. I don't want to inject my printer lines with air and then we get to put it on seems like the tube is a pretty good fit for the line that's connecting to so I'll inject just a little bit just to test and just pushing a little bit you can see all the ink that came out so I'm just gonna keep injecting and checking here so I'm feeling a certain level of paranoia Around how much ink is going through. So it's seeping through the back. So I'm gonna slide another paper towel in there. So I'm more concerned about the edge on this side of the printer because that's where most of the ink was coming out of the print head. If you're getting some resistance there, that could mean that your ink lines are clogged up possibly completely. What? What? What are you doing? I'm cleaning the printer. Hi. It's so easy I can do it.
I got a whole bottle of stuff, only cost 11 bucks. And I'm going to shoot more of this in here and use more paper towel just to make sure I've got a good clean. I'm still getting ink out of there, but with the clean solution in there, it should be breaking that down. And that's how much I took out that time. And at this point, you can tell that I'm shooting mostly solution in there. Plenty of ink in here, you can fill it in there. That's what the end looks like. Truly a print line issue. All right, all those back in place. And that's all that came out this last round. All that good. Now we can take off these cheap gloves, reassemble the printer. Clearly there's a lot of solution left in the lines. All right, I did several test pages after cleaning the printer. I also created a test sheet with some shapes that are, were all black to try and get the black to print after a cleaning the colored print lines came out nice and clear and all the bars were there. So then I ran several of these. It's printing nice and sharp, all bars clear, and before I had absolutely nothing. Good solution for 11 bucks and not that much time.